In today's video, I'm going to show you how to create a navigation bar that has multiple pages like this. So when you click on those tabs, we change to different pages. And when you click on the logo, we come back to the main page. Let's get into it. So we're going to keep everything really simple. I have this index.html file and this style.css. I'm not going to do any styling in this video. So I have the styling code ready. So if you want to copy and paste this, you can pause the video. So first we're going to create the navigation with a anchor tag for the logo. So usually we leave this anchor tags empty with putting a hashtag inside, but to create multiple pages, you got to put some HTML files inside this attribute. So we're going to give this index.html which is this file. So that means when you click on the logo, it's going to come back to this page. So let's create a unordered list with list items as well. So we are actually creating a usual navbar. Let's say home, services, products, and contact. And let's also create some content inside. Let's say main page. Let's also create a lorem text create two actually. So this page is the index.html. And to create other pages, basically going to copy and paste this one. But before doing that, let's quickly give those anchor tags their own HTML files. So let's give it a services.html, products, and contact.html. So we are going to copy and paste this four times and let's make this one home.html contact.html services and products so each one of those anchor tags have their own html file now so when you click on those as you can see in the url it changes and if we click on the logo it's going to come back to the original page. But we can't see anything changing in here because we have the same content in every page. So let's change this. Like, let's make this shorter and call this services. Let's make this contact, make it a bit shorter. Let's make this home, make it even longer. And products. And there you go. So if you look at the URL, each time you click on something, we basically route to this page and it's changing. And if you click the logo, you come back to the original index.html file. So this is how you create a navigation bar with multiple pages. Thank you guys for watching and see you next time.